The California Highway Patrol is investigating a hate crime after a hit and run on the Stanford campus. The driver apparently targeted an Arab Muslim student. As NBC Bay Area's Marianne Favre reports, now students are calling for the university to do more to keep them safe. The student who was hit is hospitalized with non-life-threatening injuries. Tonight, he is calling for students to denounce hatred. And he's also calling out Stanford for its response after he was hit. Stanford student Abdul Wahab Omira says he was walking to class yesterday afternoon when a driver hit him and yelled, F you and your people, as he sped off. Omira put out a statement shared with NBC Bay Area Saturday. In it, he was critical of Stanford, saying, The hours following the incident were agonizingly silent from the institution that I had trusted to be my safeguard. Stanford's belated response came six hours later, and the subsequent communication downplayed the severity of the incident, referring to it as a potential hate crime. Some Stanford students say as they speak out about the conflict in the Middle East, they feel unsafe on campus. And I saw um, people writing on billboards saying, um, the illusion of Israel is burning. Other students who have camped out in tents to call for a ceasefire in Gaza say they have received threats. After the hit and run, students on both sides are demanding the university do more to keep all students safe. I think that the university needs to lead with empathy. I think that there needs to be a firm stance to protect students. Um, and I think that less hesitation would be important as well. In a message to the campus community after the incident, the university said, quote, Stanford is continuing to work to provide a safe and secure campus environment in the context of heightened tensions related to the events in Israel and Gaza. This includes additional security that has been deployed at key locations on campus. But students we talk with say it's yes. not enough. The university should work to quiet down the extreme voices and bring in the people on the center. To quiet down everything that has to do with violence. In Palo Alto, Marianne Favro, NBC Bay Area News.